Alright, this is Freddie K. Myers with RWF Rocket Wrestling Federation and UCW Ultimate Championship Wrestling and you are watching Realistic Fishing. Everybody now! Welcome back to Realistic Fishing. I'm out here again to try the Strike King Bitsy Minnow once again. In a previous video, I fished it against a gulp minnow, and I couldn't even get one bite on the Bitsy. I had a bunch of people comment that it's their favorite bait, that they have confidence in it, this kind of thing. So I'm out here to try it again. Can we get a bite on the Bitsy minnow? Let's see. This is what I'm fishing with right here. Bitsy minnow in a shad pattern. It's about a one inch crankbait. Let's see if we can get a fish. Last time I fished it was at a small lake. Now we're fishing it at a big lake, 20,000 acres. It's part of the Cumberland River system. We'll see if there's anything interested in it over here. First cast, all I caught was a little bit of gunk. That's all right though, we'll keep trying. People say they've caught bass on it, panfish, trout. I would love to break the curse and finally get one so I can show you guys that it actually catches fish. But I need to catch one first to do that. I've had comments say, fish it slower, fish it quicker, pause. All sorts of different advice on how to fish it. I'm going to vary my retrieve, some fast, some slow, pauses, straight retrieves, whatever I got to do to get one fish. Just one fish. Bluegill, bass, skipjack, drum, I don't care what it is. I just want to get one. Even a green sunfish. Come on, just one fish. Do they really hate this lure that much? Let's go try down here in the creek. This is Doc from Coastal Fever TV and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Yeah, maybe down here. Fish. Oh, maybe. Maybe. I had a bite. I had something happen. Came off. Ooh, that was almost my first fish on a Bitsy Minnow. Something bit it. I felt the fish on there just for one moment. Damn it. Of course, with these tiny hooks, he didn't stay hooked, but I did get a bite. Oh, that's a snag. I gotta go get it. I don't wanna lose the lure before I even catch one fish with it. There we go. Let's keep trying. Dang it, I'm a little bummed. I got a bite, but I couldn't keep them hooked. I'm guessing it was a small bass, but I have no idea. Snagged again. This thing's getting snagged a lot. There we go.
Every once in a while I can feel it bouncing off a rock. It's good that it doesn't get snagged every time. Come on, something, grab it. Grab it good. Got him. Got him. First fish on a Bitsy Minnow. Green sunfish. Finally, the curse is over. Right here, Bitsy Minnow, green sunfish. Finally caught my first fish on a Bitsy Minnow. Confidence level going up a few clicks. Let's see if we can get another one. This is Mark Pickett from The Fishing Magician. You're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. Oh, that was a good one. Last cast with the Bitsy over here. We're going to go to a new spot if I can't get another bite. There just isn't anything going on over here. I got one green sunfish. Let's go somewhere else. All right, I've moved down to the lucky unlucky spot. And we got some gunk on there, some dead leaves. You can instantly tell when you have that on there. It stops swimming pretty much completely. Well, nothing over here at the boat ramp. Let's go down to the lucky unlucky spot. Here we are, let's give it a try. Might get a skipjack out here. Nothing here, let's keep moving. Well, Looks like someone had a party over here. Catfishing party. Got some bags of shrimp, a bunch of pop bottles, a beach ball, a dead turtle, and a bunch of trash. These people make all fishermen look bad. What a bunch of fucking shitty pigs. Yep, trashy park, trashy people. I actually see someone carting a trash can over to the pile of shit I saw. And while I usually do it after I go fishing, I'm gonna go see what this guy's deal is. I almost can't believe it. Someone is picking up the trash. I usually wait till I'm done fishing, but I had to come say hi because I've never seen another person do it in the 10 years that I've been fishing here. <laughs> yeah, I try. I can't believe people trash it like this. Well, I'm gonna help you because I'm impressed that you're actually trying to do it. Yeah, I think I saw a few more beer bottles over this oh, way. Yeah, what was your name? Oh, Doug. Doug? Yeah. All right, Doug. Nice to meet you. Hey, Thanks nice for helping you. clean up the park. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Thanks for your help.
Well, how about that? Out of all the times I've been here fishing, he is the only guy I've seen ever bend over to pick up one piece of trash. His name was Doug. Shout out to Doug. Thanks for pitching in, man. That was pretty amazing. My name's Scott from Fishing With Jesus and you're watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic. All right, I'm here at the last spot I'm gonna try for today. Yeah, catching more weeds than I am fish. Fish, fish, fish. Got my second fish, a bass. Must have swiped at it and missed because I hooked him <laughs> in the head. But I got him. Second fish of the day on the Bitsy Minnow. Check out this bass. It's not very big, but now I can say I caught a bass on the Bitsy Minnow. Bitsy Minnow bass right here. Let's let him go. Well, I think that's it for my Bitsy Minnow adventure. I got one green sunfish and one small largemouth bass. The fishing wasn't that good, but something else happened that restored a tiny bit of faith in humanity. I saw someone else willing to pick up the trash at the park. I went and helped him out. I guess that makes it a good day. Thanks for watching Realistic Fishing. Keep it realistic.